Hi, I'm Chloe and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well. Today, I want to do a review on Chanel Wallet on Chain Black Caviar Leather with Gold Hardware. I want to share everything including the details, pros and cons, what I carry in it and the mod chat. And you can see the lookbook on my next video. I'm gonna show you this wallet on chain with various outfits there. You can check that out if you wanna see more mod chat. Then let's get started. When it comes to the measurement, it's about 19 centimeters in width, 13 centimeters in height, and 4 centimeters in depth. The chain drops about 64 centimeters. And the chain is less than one centimeter. The front, the back, the side, the other side, and the bottom. As you can see, it's got the snap button closure. It says Chanel Paris on the button and it says Chanel on the flap like so under the zipper and the zipper pocket here on the flap goes all the way down to the bottom like so I have no idea what it's called in English but there is kind of a leather cover for the chain the chain is movable there are six card slot one flat pocket and one zipper pocket inside it says made in spain on the flat pocket and there is another flat pocket on the front you can see the authenticity number there it's supposed to be as the same as the one on the black warranty card the side and the bottom are gossip style like this It can be this big at the most. It's quite flexible. They both are in caviar leather, but this wallet on chain is much puffier than my card case. I've researched about it on the internet and some said wallet on chain which is made in Spain is much puffier than the others. I like it. I prefer puffier one. Then now, let's see what fits inside. I'm gonna try to put this Rebecca Minkoff sunglasses case, Louis Vuitton clay, Dior lip pouch, Chanel card case, flat card holder, and Louis Vuitton min pochette. They fit in one by one, like so, but it doesn't hold anything else if I put this kind of pouch in it. You know, pouches are quite bulky, whatever they are. No matter how small they are, they take some space anyway. So, I put everything without pouch or a case. As its name suggests, it's just a wallet. You don't put a pouch in a wallet, do you? You shouldn't expect more than a wallet for this one. It's not a bag technically. I think it's just a wallet with chain as the name suggests. So I have to take everything out of the pouch or case to put them inside. Maybe I need to take out the sunglasses. It's too bricky. And 
that's it. If you cram, you can put more items in it. But if you do that, the leather is gonna stretch and the shape is gonna be ruined. I don't recommend to put too much inside. It's just a wallet. So these are what I normally carry inside. And I put my iPhone in it. It's perfect. It's enough for me. For your reference, I'm 169 centimeters in height and the chain drops about 64 centimeters. As a shoulder bag, it looks like this on me. And yes, it's quite long. My hips are here. My waist is here. And my pervis is here. It doesn't look that bad, but it's definitely long. It's gonna be more obvious if you wear this wallet on chain on jeans or pants. As a crossbody, it's a little shorter, but still long. It's okay for me. I don't care about the length, but if you are shorter than me, I think you will find it too long for you. It hits the bottom side of my hips. My waist is here. You can see how long it is. You can also use it as a clutch bag and it looks like this on me. You can grab it in this way or you can use it like this. And as a chain wristlet, it looks like this. Cross number one, it's got lots of compartment. As you can see, it's got the zipper pocket on the flap and it goes all the way down here. And it's got a lot of compartment inside as well. It's very great to keep something separately thanks to the compartment. It's very practical, easy to use. And the use of back pocket is amazing. I love it. Pros number two. It's perfect as a crossbody bag. If you are a big fan of crossbody, you will love this because it's quite flat. Look at the side, it doesn't bother me at all as a crossbody. One of my favorite bag, Louis Vuitton Alma BB, is just perfect as a tote bag like this. But as a crossbody bag, I don't wear it that much because it's quite bricky and it easily bumps into anything around me because of the wide bottom as you can see it doesn't look that natural as a crossbody because of the shape but when it comes to this Chanel wallet on chain it's just perfect as a crossbody bag pros number three it's versatile it can be a shoulder bag crossbody bag mini handbag wristlet clutch bag
a wallet or inner pouch. It doesn't have any metallic piece on the outside, so when you put it in and take it out of the bag as a pouch, it's very smooth. Pros number four, it can be my personal opinion, but it's very pretty. I love the classic shape of this one. It looks great on any kind of outfit. I love it. Now, let me talk about the cons. Cons number one, the chain strap is quite long. You can make this one shorter by tying this part like this. You can adjust the length like this. Then it's gonna be this short. I don't do it, I just use it the way it is. But if you find it too long, you can make it shorter in this way. Cons number two. This moving chain strap is quite uncomfortable to use. Sometimes I need to handle this bag with one hand, but it's hard because the chain keeps moving. Cons number three. The side of the flap will get wear and tear easily because of the chain. The chain keeps rubbing this part and this part when it moves. And because of the design, the chain is supposed to pull the flap like this all the time. So the both side of the flap will get stretched and wear and tear eventually no matter how well you take care of this bag. Cons number 4, you need to take care of the leather zipper pullers whenever you close this bag. You need to do this before you close it. Otherwise, it's gonna be like this. Can you see this? It's quite annoying. If you consider it as a bag, you won't be satisfied because it doesn't hold that much. But if you consider this as a wallet, you will love it because it holds a lot as a wallet. If you are looking for a mini bag, I don't recommend this one, but if you are looking for a big wallet which can be a crossbody, you will love it. If you need any further information, feel free to ask me on YouTube comment below. And thank you very much for watching my video.